Hi guys, I have just bought an Alienware M15R4. This is how it looks like. Let's switch it on. I want to erase Windows and replace it by Ubuntu. So we need first set up the BIOS. Now let's press F2 to enter BIOS and go to Advanced. We change the SATA operation to AHCI. And uh, I want to erase Windows, so let's choose Yes. And uh, after that, we need disable Secure Boot. So now let's go to Security, Secure Boot, and change the Secure Boot mode into Disable. Then we can save the changes and to install Ubuntu. So the tip is we should use the safe graphics in the bootable USB sticks. And uh, so now we need to price actually F12. And uh, we choose the boot device to USB. Actually, we have list. We don't want to put into Windows, so let's choose USB 1. And uh, now, as I told you, so in this menu, we should change the Ubuntu save graphics. Otherwise, actually, everything will look really ugly. Then, so we basically just do everything blindly. We just follow the instructions by the bootable USB. And uh, the procedure is quite standard. What's tricky actually is what happens after the installation of Ubuntu. We have to install the NVIDIA drivers. Let's so keep the steps. So basically here in this menu, we just click install Ubuntu, then choose English, etc, etc. After the installation of Ubuntu, then we boot the laptop by the Ubuntu, then what happens to me is I see a black screen after I boot into the Ubuntu. And also I didn't see actually the grab menu. So here, of course, we need follow these steps to first modify the grab configuration. We need to press Control, Alter F3, or actually you can also Press F4, F5, F6. Then you log in in the console mode. So now let's modify the grab file under etc default. So now you should use the sudo. You need modify first the grab timeout from 0 to 10, for example. Then you change the grab timeout style to manual. Then you save the change and update the grab, then we reboot. This time, so you will see the grab menu like this. Let's choose the advanced options and we boot into the recovery mode. You should see the GUI, the GUI login screen. So now let's log in. After this, we need to download the drivers from NVIDIA website. So now let's open a browser. Let's Google NVIDIA drivers English. I have actually the GTX 3070 laptop and of course for Linux 64. Then let's download it. After we download it, we need actually a C compiler. So now let's open a terminal. And uh, you can apt install the build essential, for example. Actually, I have already installed it. So after we install the build essential, we can just install the driver file we just downloaded. So now let's go to the downloads folder and uh, we can run the driver file. Well, let's I forgot it, so let's look it up. 
Now let's copy the driver file name and run it using sh. You just install it step by step, follow the instruction. You just basically just click yes and OK, etc. After installation, you just run nvidia-smi, then you should see a list like this one. So it just tells you, okay, you have installed the nvidia driver successfully. So now actually you can enjoy your one too. And good luck. And thank you for watching.